Hey guys, welcome back to Tip Tuesday. Today I am talking about things that you need to stock up on at the dollar store. So my name is Kristen. I am sister number two from Six Sisters Stuff and welcome back to Tip Tuesday. Now before I get started, if you haven't done so, make sure you subscribe to our channel and push that little bell so you can get all of our notifications for Tip Tuesday. So over the past month, every single week I went to the dollar store and I'd purchase different things. I'd price check different things at different stores. And so I've come up with a list of 30 things that you will want to stock up on at the dollar store, whether it's good product or it's awesome prices compared to other places. All right, I'm headed to the dollar store one more time to check out a few more things and then I will show you my list of 30 things that I buy at the dollar store. Here we go. The first one is decorations. Every time I go into the Dollar Tree, they have decorations on every wall for the next three seasons coming up. Number two, seeds. So every year, this is actually where we buy our seeds. They're a quarter for just one pack or four for a dollar, which is great. They have all the vegetables, flowers, you name it, they have it. Number three, seasonal party supplies. So whatever season's coming up, they have all the supplies for it for your goodie bags. I love it because it's not all candy. Number four, dishes. Now this might sound funny, but as a food photographer, I buy all kinds of dishes from the dollar store. They have white ones. These ones are fun, colorful. You should check them out. Now this is probably one of my most favorite spots to get gift bags because they have gift bags for boys, for girls, for every size, big or small. Then you go to seasonal. They have seasonal bags for everything, which are usually darling. And don't forget the baby bags. Those can get expensive in the other stores. And tissue paper, you get 35 for just a dollar. Number six, gardening supplies. Now, I bet you didn't know that there are gardening supplies from gloves to shovels to little rakes to all kinds of stuff that you need to work in your garden. My most favorite thing are those big pots up top. You can easily paint them if you wanted to. And then they have all different kinds of colors of smaller sizes. Number seven, vases. Now go tell your significant other to buy one of these vases, not one from the flower store. Number eight, plastic or paper colored products. Now they have every color you possibly imagine from tablecloths to utensils to plates, you name it. Number nine, cards. Now you can get any kind of card here from birthdays to anniversaries to pretty much you name it for 50 cents to a dollar. You can also get thinking of you or thank you cards. You get eight of them for a dollar. Now we're gonna talk about wrapping paper and bows. We've already done bags, but these are a whole nother beast. They have so many different options of wrapping paper and it's only a dollar. Plus every color of bow you can possibly imagine, which is my five-year-old's heaven. Number 11, party supplies. And I swear you can never have enough of these things from candles, number candles, to birthday banners, birthday things to celebrate. My favorite are the balloons. You can buy a ton of balloons for a great price. Number 12, games. Now games are kind of hit and miss because they sell out pretty quick. So you can buy dice, there's silly putty, there's letter blocks, there's golf games. Um, this is the Chinese checkers. There's giant dice, which my kids love. But this thing, left, center, right, if you have never played this, I highly suggest it. I paid $10 on Amazon for this thing. Number 13, we're going to call busy activities. So whether you're going on a car trip, a plane trip, or you need to entertain your kids for like 20 minutes, whether it's a doctor's appointment, they have so many great things. These little mosaics, my kids can spend hours putting these together. Make sure you dig behind because they have all kinds of different things. Number 14, we're going to call it so many crafts because literally they have every child's dream of crafting here. So sometimes I'll take my girls and like, okay, you have $3, pick three craft things. They even have Mod Podge. Yep, they do. Number 15, glow sticks. We use glow sticks all year round, whether it's a glow in the dark bath, whether it's glow in the dark soccer. I mean, you can use them all the time. So my kids absolutely love them and I always have a ton on stock whenever we need something fun to do. 
Number 16, mailing supplies. Now as funny as it sounds, I used to sell things on eBay and I would go get all of my mailing supplies from the dollar store. It was so much cheaper. From envelopes to tape to these big padded mailing bags, they're only a dollar compared to up to five dollars at the post office. Then you have brown paper if you need to cover some stuff up. You also have padding if you need to wrap something up to protect it. Number 17, poster boards. Now these are the thick poster boards that I'm talking about. They're about $2.50 at any other place, but the, at the dollar store, they're only a dollar. Plus you can find almost every color of a normal poster board. Number 18, learning and coloring books. If you have a little one who loves to learn, grab some of these extra things like grade one, kindergarten, they're perfect. Number 19, teacher supplies. Now I do have to admit, if you're not a teacher, this might not be useful for you, but I have kids in preschool. I have little things that these are perfect and work for things if I'm working on things at home. Number 20, dry erase markers. All right, I brought these home, I tried them, and they actually work awesome, and they're only a dollar. Number 21, tools. I had no idea the dollar store had tools until I started researching. They have all kinds of stuff, and they have one of these hand grabber things. Okay, my kids love these things. That's an awesome gift to even get them. They have tweezers, they have pliers, they have screwdrivers, even tough handy gloves. They even have small toolboxes that will fit the basics. Number 22, workout videos. If you're like me, I like to change up my workup a lot. They had Jillian workouts everywhere here. And instead of paying five to $10, it's a dollar. Number 23, Advil. Now I'm funny about brands, but they have the real Advil brand Perfect for throwing in your purse, in your suitcase, on the go. It's perfect. Number 24, plastic containers. Now being someone who works with food a lot, I use these all the time and I usually pay about $3 for something like this. But here at the dollar store, they're just a dollar. And these ones are smaller and they come with four for a dollar. Number 25, toothbrushes. Now, these are Colgate toothbrushes that are usually a dollar at the store. You can get three here. Number 26, baggies, plastic, and foil. Now how much do you usually pay for baggies? It's a lot because I pay too. These ones are Reynolds wrappers. They are foil sheets all ready to go. And then the next one you can just buy normal aluminum foil. It's a different brand but if that doesn't matter to you, also wax paper, 65 feet. Number 27, kitchen pans. Now these next items I have actually purchased all of them and loved all of them. So we have muffin tins, to a grilling tray, to bread pans. They have all kinds of stuff here. They also have brownie pans. This one's a little bit bigger. Then they have a smaller one that's a square, either for brownies or cake. They also have round cake pans. The one thing I would suggest is do not wash them in the dishwasher, hand wash everything, or they go a little rusty. Number 28, kitchen utensils. Now I'm pretty picky about my utensils, but they have an awesome pizza cutter. And I really like the basting brush for larger things. Also the Turner spatulas were awesome, whether the ones with holes or without, both were good. I also really like their colorful dish towels. Number 29, aluminum pans. Now lots of times I make leftovers or I do freezer meals or I go deliver them to friends and so to buy two of those aluminum pans are about $2.50 to $3 at any other store. Here you can get two of them for a dollar. They also have big ones for like your turkey dinners, your ham dinners, that kind of stuff. You can also get three bread pans that have little lids, perfect for banana bread. And last but not least, cleaning supplies. Especially if you're going to try out some new cleaning supplies that you haven't used before, I would highly suggest getting the dollar store ones because they come a little bit smaller. You can try them out, see if you like them. They have all kinds of brands. I love to get the smaller kinds, especially when I'm doing a new laundry detergent. Perfect for testing, make sure your kids aren't allergic, and also perfect for taking all these things when you're traveling and you just need a small size and not a huge size of your cleaning supplies. And also part of your cleaning supplies, don't forget to grab sponges while you're there. Perfect for the kitchen, bathroom, everything. And those are my 30 things. So next time you're out shopping, 
maybe think about heading to the dollar store before you go out to save yourself some money. All right, guys, thanks for joining me today on Tip Tuesday. I hope you all have a wonderful day.